Hey, what's up, guys? It's Sam Ray. How are you guys doing today? I hope you guys are having a fantastic day. Today, it is Saturday, and today is the Kansas race. What is No, it's the Gold Bowling 400. I remember when it was the SpongeBob SquarePants 400. That was like a fun weekend. Very rainy this morning. Indeed. Okay guys, so I'm about to film a video where I rage about NASCAR, got my stuff down there for that. I'm about to film it, got everything set up, and I'll probably maybe do the behind the scenes during it, but maybe not. So, I'll see you guys after the video. If like, you know, if you live in like South, like Alabama, or freaking South Carolina, or freaking like, down in the deep crap of America, then they'll let you watch the race in class, because they're... They're rednecks, but here in freaking New York, they're not gonna let you watch the race during class because all they care about is croquet. They care about freaking throw the ball to the end zone and throw a ball in a hoop. They don't care about anything else. Just sitting here waiting, wasting my time. You guys see that stuff in there? That stuff is some of the rubble from the schoolwork I did last school year. And we're gonna add to that this summer we're gonna put all my schoolwork in that fire and it's gonna be great because this year has probably been the worst year school wise of my life the education has just been like so nonsense this year far into it though what if like kim and sophia walks in the door right now and sees me um, excuse me? Bad. Move! You look depressed. Are you alright? Oh, you're just gonna turn away from me? Like I don't matter? Well, I'm sorry for not mattering enough, Vinny. Yay. I just missed Larry the Cable Guy. I missed it. it. Okay, here we go. Ryan Blaney's on pole. Joey Logano second. I'm excited to see some racing here. Night racing, freaking finally. Only took like 75 billion suicide attempts. What? No, shut up. More green. For a boring race, but excited that it's a night race. I probably shouldn't even be filming because nothing's gonna happen. Excellent. We have our first caution out for freaking Landon Castle. He got into the wall. No biggie, but it's gonna be a caution. And they're green. Now this is gonna happen. I'm gonna turn this off. Guys, guess what? Landon Castle had troubles again. Landon Castle. Oh my gosh. Whoa. Well, there's trouble on pit road. Uh, Chase Elliott got into uh, freaking whoever the 95 is. I think it's Ty Dillon this year, but no, Ty Dillon's on the 13. I think it's for a while it was Michael McDowell. Again, the game that I played, Scott Speed. Last year it was Ty Dillon. I think it's Michael McDowell. And that's trouble for Ty Dillon in the 13. He spun out, which sucks. Yeah, that was a right front tire, and then he wasn't doing good at all. Gotta see this. He slowed down. Oh, he just lost it. But at least he didn't hit anything. So that was a good save. Okay, Kyle Busch second. Let's see his good restart. Hopefully it works. It did not work. It worked, 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 it twerked, it twerked. You guys want to see me twerk? Too bad you don't get to. I know you wanted to, though. I really do know that you wanted to. Kyle Busch got the lead, pulls away, and this is his race. Looks like Kyle Busch is going to win stage number one. It'll be his first time winning the stage in, well, in the Cup Series. He swept all of them last night, but and since uh, Daytona, when he won stage one, he was the first ever cup stage winner, and then he crashed. But yeah, Kyle Busch wins stage one tonight at Kansas. Looks like he has a great shot tonight for the rest of the night. Hopefully he can do great. Guys, look how sexy I look. Don't you just think I'm so sexy? Don't I just look so sexy? 
I know, right? I don't. So they went back green. Kyle Bush is in second. Truex has the lead. Jets leading. Larson is in third. Kyle Bush almost had it. But nope. Well, there's trouble for Eric Jones right there. Don't know what happened. I heard tire screeches because apparently they had like his in-car audio. Didn't sound good. Come on, Kyle. Get past him. Yes. There we go. Now that's Kyle's. The rest of the stage is Kyle's now. Unless we got like cautions. Because he took the lead and it's impossible to get it back from him. Jimmy Johnson has trouble. He's slowed down. He's in 35th. Probably, yeah, 35th now. He's falling back fast. It's not good. Yeah, he has a, he has a tire. See that? Here, they're going to have to take it to the garage or put out a caution. I think they're going to be able to take it to the garage. No, no, not the garage. Pit road. He got into Kurt Busch and then fell straight back. Caution is out. From the 48 at lap 102. Oh, that's the debris. Wow, that's an inner panel there. That's a. They just went back green. Kyle Busch has the lead, of course, obviously, because he's better than everyone else. 55 laps to go in stage two. Catch up when something happens. Trouble for Greg Golden. Cautions out. And we're having a lot of cautions tonight. Eighth caution tonight. That's insane. Greg Golding has trouble though. Engine blew up, and he's gonna probably bring that to the garage. Guys, well, you probably did not see that, but that little thing that you just saw was Jupiter, with its like many moons. Okay, here we go. We got eight laps to go in stage two. Green flag back in the air. Ryan Blaney and Kyle Larson, Truex and Kyle Busch. It's Greg Golding again. Six laps to go on the stage. If the caution comes out. Oh, there's uh, Ryan Newman. The caution comes out now. I might not be able to go back green in the stage, which I hate. Sometimes I like when races races end under caution, but I don't like when stages end under caution. But it looks like they'll both make it to pit road, and hopefully. And final lap of the stage. Ryan Blaney's leading. Will he win the stage? Will he not? And Ryan Blaney wins stage number two. There he goes. Stage two winner for the Wood Brothers. So there's your stage winners. First and fifth. And the final stage will be 107 laps. So obviously the last stage is longer than the rest of them, but 107 laps tonight. And there's trouble for Paul Menard and AJ Almendinger right here with 74 laps to go. AJ Almendinger, I mean at least he's not upside down in Paul Menard. Well, yeah, he's doing normal pulmonary stuff, so, I mean, next we know the tires are going to literally explode into flames. That happened one time at Homestead. It was pretty funny, I guess. <laughs> and there's Blaney, Truex, Kyle Busch off third. That's good. Then Larson, Hamlin, Harvick, Kane, Logano, Kurt Busch, and McMurray. Back to green, Blaney, Truex, Kyle Busch, Kyle Larson. Looks like Truex might pull away. Blaney's not going to pull away. Kyle Busch falls back to Kyle Larson. Blaney now gets ahead, but it's a battle. Truex looks like he might get by. Yep, Truex gets by. Kyle Busch and Kyle Larson battling it out for second. Well, Truex cleared Blaney. Now here's Kyle looking for... Man, I'm like MRN right now. Oh, that's a huge crash! Eric Amarola involved. Oh my gosh. That's definitely going to be a red flag. What? I looked down at Snapchat for two seconds, and this happens. Logano is moving around in there. That was a. Oh gosh. And then that's exactly when I turned the camera on. Red flag is out. They're trying to get the the roof off the car so they can get him out. I, I just hope he's okay because usually when they have to cut the roof off, I remember back in 2012, I think it was Talladega and Xfinity race. Eric McClure hit the hit the wall hard. They had to get the roof off of it, and he was transported to the hospital. So hope it's not that serious. But that was a hard crash. Oh, he can't get out because of the roll cage. The roll cage is like deformed, so he can't get out. Yeah, they got Eric Amarola on the stretcher. They're getting him on the stretcher. 
So yeah, guys, he's on the stretcher. Daddy was texting me, asking me about it, because he saw a video that I retweeted on Twitter. A hard crash. I mean, he's on the stretcher right now. You can see him. I hope he can race next week. Next week is the race that he still does not have a chance at. I think if he was really injured, they wouldn't they wouldn't show us. But he got a neck brace on. Reminds me of uh, what I couldn't do. That video from the Psycho series where Uncle Larry was sitting up with the neck brace on the bed after he drove into the pool. A lot of us took a hard hit and... Um... I had something broke in my car. I don't, I don't know what it was. It, I noticed it as I was going in and tried to back off, but you're going. Joey says that he's okay. It's good. Well, there we go. That's what. That's the remains of Eric Amarola's car. They let the cars. They're back under caution now. So 67 laps to go, and red flag has been lifted. It's about a 30-minute red flag. The crash happened at 10:23, so 29-minute red flag. See, you know, this is still better than a 30-minute red flag that we had, you know, 10 laps before the season ended last year. So I was nervous out of my mind, like, is Kyle going to win the championship for an extra 30 minutes than I should have been, which is ridiculous. Eric Almirola is going to the hospital here in Kansas City, or not here, but there in Kansas City. Forgot there's still a race to be run, so here we go with that. Truex is leading. Ryan Blaney's in second. Looks like he's trying to take the lead from him. Yep. Gets clear him, please. Oh my god. Please clear him. Caution's out for Eric Jones. Worse this time than it was last time. Green flag in the air. Junior. Bain. We got Ryan Blaney and Kyle Busch trying to pull out. Blaney's in second now. Oh, going up for first. Trying to get first. Kyle Busch in third right now. Oh my gosh. Look at all that. Look at all that. Look at all that. Martin Truex Jr. takes the lead. And there's trouble for Corey LaJoy with 24 to go. I'm actually pretty happy to see that. So guess who's leading right now? Not Blaney, but Eric Jones. Back green. Last time that we've had two consecutive first-time winners was in 2007 at Charlotte and Dover with Casey Mears and Chuex. No, not Chuex. <laughs> ah! Man, like worse than Buddy Holly's death. <laughs> it's, <laughs> it's pretty bad. <laughs> Spoiler alert, guys! I didn't really spoil it because I, I actually purposefully waited a little longer. But Eric Jones again! I'd be down for Kurt Busch winning, even though he's already won a race. Believe it or not, he's only led two laps this season. Uh, I mean, as of like a few weeks ago when I last checked. He led the one lap at Daytona, and he led like another lap at another race. Five laps to go. True X Blaney, Harvick, Bush, Johnson, Come on, Blaney! Come on, Blaney. Come on, Blaney. Oh, trouble! Johnson! I believe you don't have to worry about him anymore, but... No caution? Yep, there's the caution. Okay. Well, it's 11.40 right now. Okay, now remember at the beginning of the night when I said I should not turn my camera on because it's just going to be a boring race anyway? <laughs> yeah, that... Don't judge a book by its cover. Here we go. Come on, Blaney. Come on. Is that Kislowski there? Didn't he, like, have problems earlier, too? And it looks like Truex has got it at this point, which sucks. I, I don't dislike Truex. I just really wanted either Kyle Busch or Ryan Blaney to win. So Truex Jr. comes. Gonna beat Kislowski. Harvick. Blaney's gonna finish fourth. Truex Jr. wins at Kansas. There was another Kyle and Kyle show. I think, yeah, Kyle got fifth, so. Well, which Kyle? No, Austin Dillon. So, yeah, I would have made another joke about another driver, but then I realized, yeah, he did slam the wall, so I decided not to make that joke. Like how I did with uh, Richard Petty. <laughs> I'm, I'm an awful person. I'll say this track owes him, like, five. Because at the, like 2012, he was racing Denny Hamlin, and he almost won. He didn't. It was 2015, I think, too, that he was racing. Like, that was the, during his big, long winless streak. Last year, too, he had issues. Almost was going to win, but didn't. So this, this track owes him, like, five races. So I can't be mad about one. And I'm not even mad. I just wanted to, I just wanted Blaney or Kyle Busch to win. So guys, it's like after midnight. It's like 12:12. 12, 12. 
not 11 11 12 12 so i'm gonna end the vlog right here for you guys i want to thank you guys for watching please like subscribe and comment I'll probably update you guys on eric tomorrow um stay strong guys have a fantastic day today and i will see you later